leaving Big Daddy as king of the watering hole. When it comes to combat, Big isn't always best. These creatures are so ferocious, they'll fight to the death. Battling on, even after they've been decapitated. In Africa, even the smallest animals have to fight for their right to survive. As ant colonies grow, they need more and more food. The fastest way to secure it is a violent takeover of their neighbor's land. With two armies, both more than 10,000 strong, this battle will have a high body count. Any ant warrior that takes the field may not make it home alive. The inch-long soldiers lead the attack. They send out pheromones for others to join them. African ants have a heart-shaped head equipped with their major weapon, the mandibles. Ant mandibles are curved with a jagged edge like a saw. They're made of chitin, the same as their exoskeleton, but are reinforced with proteins that make them even stronger to cut through the bodies of their enemies. Using their mandibles, the ants lock together with all their might. Their goal, rip off their rival's limbs and target the vulnerable area between the head and chest. And they work together to take out their opposition. The ant on the right uses her mandibles to hold her opponent down, while the ant on the left tries to saw her head off. are one of Animal Fight Club's ultimate contenders. Because even if they do succeed in severing a rival's body part, just like in a zombie movie, the incomplete body can keep on fighting. This hand is fighting against a head and an arm that has been severed from its body. Ants have a simple nervous system. Their basic movements are controlled by bundles of nerves called ganglia, spread out along their bodies. When an ant loses a head or other body part, the ganglia continue to generate movement. This disembodied head can fight on for hours, or until its body fluid runs out. The fight won't be over until every last ounce of energy has been spent. as the battlefield becomes littered with the dying body parts of the defenders. It becomes clear the invaders have won a grisly victory. Their territory and food supply has just gotten a whole lot bigger. You may sometimes think males have only one thing on their mind. 